What's up guys? Welcome back to Exactly Gaming. My name is Zach and today we are back with more Small Saga. That's right. Now last time we left off, we were going around gathering Gwen's final weapon called Urin, which we found in the sewers, aptly named, and also Siobhan's final weapon using a fuel called Naphtha we found in the Mole Village, so when we went back to Cranbale. So had a couple of really good battles and uh, now we are back to Merida. So Dizzy has been flying us all around and we're going to go back to this pub and see if we can organize this final little charge on the capital here and see if we can get some things done because we've got a yellow god to kill. Thomas? Stage your business! Alright, Thomas, we're just rolling through. Where is he at? Thomas? I may as well have let you slug brains through. You'd only sneak in some other way. Yeah, you're right, Thomas. We definitely would. Alright. Let's go this way. What's this dude doing? Just, just fishing for trash up there, man? Just trash fishing? Alright, let's go this way. Up this way. By this guy, needle in a haystack there, a little kid running back and forth. Oh, wait, we needed to go back to the pub. We passed it. Alright, back to the pub. Alright, don't mind the drunk. Let's see, does he have anything else? It all goes back to that stupid blonde twink. Alright, well, yep, Alex, you're just gonna be drunk in the alleyway, I guess. Alright, I think we may be ready to kick things off, so let's see. Go talk to Bree. Are you ready? Uh, I'm ready. Are, are you sure you've said your prayers at a statue and everything? Because this is it. Our point of no return. Once we do this, there's no going back. Uh, I'm really ready, I'm sure. Alright, we only get one more shot at this, so let's run over the plan one more time. Tonight is the night. Soon the yellow god will knock upon our door. A terrifying prospect, but I'm not afraid. We could still initiate Proposal 99, the city evacuation plan. Your Majesty, this may be our last opportunity. For the last time, there's no need. I have faith in Aquila and Excalibur. We do not need that accursed weapon. Where is the Plague Master, anyway? In their lab, desecrating some corpse, I expect. Here's Alex. <clears throat> not drunk in the alleyway anymore. Your Royal Majesty, Lord Master Orpheus, Leo, you reek of alcohol, Sir Alex. Did you abandon your post just to go wallow in a tavern gutter? There's good intel to be gained from tavern gutters, Needle Knight. <laughs> Why, the things you overhear? Out with it. There's an unsavory gathering happening tonight in the slums. Hundreds of rodents, all threatening to march on the palace. A protest? Without a license? Who are the organizers? I don't know their names, but some devil-tailed vagabond mouse with a god sword was chief among them. He looked familiar. Vagabond? N no, that's impossible. For the peasants to revolt on tonight of all nights. It is no coincidence. They must have caught wind of the imminent danger above us. So it is opportunistic rebellion, then. They wish to leverage the chaos to overthrow me, just like they did with the Squirrel Duke. Well, I don't know about that, but yes, this is a security concern. Blade Master, why are you just standing around? Get out there and quash this petty uprising. My duty, uh, my duty is to protect you, Your Majesty, and th to that end, it is vital I remain at your side. If the Blade Master has come down with a case of the lily livers, I would be more than willing to lead the troops. Not an option, Alex. You cannot be trusted with authority. That much you've demonstrated time and time again. What are you talking about? The Sterling Knight has an excellent track record. It's right there in his title. Get out there and bash some skulls, Sir Alex. With grace and might, Your Majesty. Oh, shit. Now that there's a soldier who remembers what he's fighting for, who knows? Maybe he's due for a promotion. I don't think so. I think Sir Alex is about to get his ass whipped. Uh-oh. Ready? That's all four of us, then. Right on time. And we still have three hours until the 13th chime, the witching hour. I was hoping for a bigger crowd, though. Oi, this is a bit pitiful. Oi, Stilton. Where is everyone? I don't know. We knocked on doors, we handed out leaflets. I swear we got hundreds of RSVPs. Psh. The people want change, but they don't want to put their necks on the line. Well, can't say I blame them. It is all a bit intimidating, ain't it? We can still do this, right? Everyone, gather around and listen up. 
This is it. This is the night. We're going to march up our tourist street, march past the Ratlis, and march right into the royal palace. Then we're going to find the king and demand that he listen to our voices. Anything to add, Verm? No. <laughs> no. Fair enough. A mouse a few words. Excuse me. This protest is being held without a proper license. On His Majesty's orders, please disperse immediately and return to your homes. The guard are here already? Did someone rat us out? Severm, what should we do? We fight. There's no time to waste. Let's knock him out and push through. Now we're talking. Let's rock. Yeah, I'm not. We're done. This is. Yeah, we're done. These two fucks, I'm done. I'm done. We're done. We're not. Yeah, we're done. We're done, guys. Hey, I'm done. I just want you to know. Nothing against you. I really forgot and was supposed to do a double attack there, but I didn't, so that's fine. We're just going to end this real fast. What is the last ability she did? Hellfire? Deal extreme special damage. Let's just test it out. 40? Yeah, why not? Let's just see. <laughs> yeah, I'd say that was extreme. Sky Vault. Deal damage, lower both defense and attack. Yeah, why not? Let's just give him everything we got. Whoa, where's she going? Oh, 49? Jesus. Oi, oi, what's all this violence? What happened to the plan? Sheesh, well, uh, in for a seed, in for a sapling, I suppose. Let's move, quickly. Yeah, we're not... I'm not... Oh, yeah, we're, we're fighting. We're not talking anymore. We're done. Look, mate, we... We have a right to protest, you know. Not tonight, you don't. Pack it in right now or spend the night behind bars. This is mad. I've never seen no, the guards so proactive. There's no reasoning with them. Step aside. Yeah, I'm about to mess them up. We're just gonna keep going. You guys better be stronger than the last two. Alright. Bladestorm. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Come on. <laughs> and I did damage to the other guy. Come on, Siobhan, just do him in. Yeah, <laughs> why not? Let's just finish him off. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Your protest ends here, hooligan scum. If it's violence you want, it's violence you'll get, not Big Dan. <laughs> How far is the Thimble Guard fallen? Who is it? Oh, is that Leo? R Rosaline? My sister's still recovering, but I'm here. Oh, the Guard's a broken organization in a broken kingdom. It was a f I was a fool for supporting it. Let me lend my sword to your cause. Fine by us. Oi, the more the merrier. Yeah. Uh-oh, Alex. In that, is that Rosaline? That tenacious minx, she's come from my head. The barricade's all set up, Sir Alex, sir. Good, don't let a single one of the bastards through. What the? How are we meant to get through this? Verm, let's find a way around and flank them. Right. All right, let's go this way. What do you got? The guards are prowling. If any ask, I'll tell them you four ran the other way. Hey, thanks. Good doing business with you. Uh-oh. Ma'am? Sir? Whatever you are, you can't be here. Get back inside. Are you serious? I'm not doing anything. It doesn't matter what you're doing. I said get back inside. Oh, that's Little Dan, not Big Dan. Why? Are we doing curfews now or something? Yeah, you gonna tuck us in? Give us a bedtime story? Shut it up there. You're both starting to piss me off. Whoa, 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 sorry, you, you lot need to go home. Uh, we're just passing through. That's not possible, please disband immediately. You're being too polite, Bob. I'll show you how to handle these low-life reprobates. Fucking little Dan and Bob here. Oh, shit. Oh, ho, ho. This is Murida's finest? <laughs> They're nothing but ungodly Cashwin. Sir George, fancy seeing you outside of Whitehall. Gwen, fancy seeing you instigating yet more chaos. You're the same as ever, stubborn and petulant. But you did open my eyes to the horrors of the gods. If the yellow god is as accursed as the white, then that is not a deity worth of worship. I'm here to fight by your side. Well, your help is, appreci your help is appreciated. Thanks for coming. Verm, let's mosey. All right, fuck yeah. George, George in the house. Can I have a little coffee break? Coffee break? How you doing? Hey, cafe's closed. I'm busy cleaning up. What kind of caffeine addict wants coffee right before bedtime anyway? Sorry. I guess we'll head out. That's a nice flower. All right, let's go. Oh, Andy's gone. You okay? You've got guts. There's hope for murder yet. What about the painting? How's that going? What's all the ruckus? 
I want to join your protest, but I can't paint from a prison cell. Hey, that's fine. Your job is to create art for the world, okay? Okay? Let's go talk to old Rumpelstiltskin man. Nope, can't go up there. Never mind. We won't. <laughs> Uh-oh. Man, I'm sleepy. What's Alex thinking getting everyone up at this hour? Hey, get it together, Vicky. We've got a king to protect. Hey, hey, where'd you lot come from? Don't move. You're all under arrest. What a pain. There's no end to these tin heads. Yeah, all right. We'll, we'll stop. Oh, hey, there we go. Keep your paws off the air of Cranbale. Blademaster Neiman? What are you doing here? Did Mammy send you? She did. But she didn't ask me to drag you home. She told me to support you however I can. If this fight is important to you, and if this is who you are, then I will stand by your side. Thank you, Neiman. Let's go. We're almost, let's go. We're almost at the barricade. All right, yeah, let's go. Let's save it. Good as time as any for a double save, so you know we're doing it. You know what, guys? I know we're getting crazy, but we're doing it. We're doing the triple save. Yeah, I know. That's insane. But it's never been done before, I don't think. Severm. We'll head to the palace after we've removed the barricade. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I forgot we had to get that barricade. Let's go. What? How did you get past the barricade? Well, whatever. Let's get this over with. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's get this over with indeed. We're just going to blade storm. I don't have time to rage. We'll probably beat him this turn anyway. So, I, yeah. We're just going to finish him off. Nice. And we apply bleeding. Hell yeah, she's gonna do spread fire to all enemies. And she's, yeah, I mean, we're gonna do Sky Vault if we can, right? It's the most fun. God, that's amazing. Barricade down, let's go. Yeah, Stilton. Nicely done, you four. No time to waste, to the palace. Alright, just gonna go up here. What's up here? Is there anything we can do up here for now? Anything in the anything going on in the dock? Anything happening here? Nothing exciting at the dock? Maybe the last time we see the dock, guys. I don't know. I don't know how how into the yellow god battle this is gonna go, but I think we're we're barreling towards the end here. Oh, did they ha oh no, they didn't have anything else. Yeah, Stilton was here. Yeah, a little Stussy up there on the wall. Nice, nice. Alright, let's go. Popping over here. Oh! All right, that's the wharf secured. What's next? Oh, hey! Damn it, we're so close. Let's go! Oh, <laughs> fucking Anton, damn. Anton, why are you here? I want to fight too, Lapa. Babe, I love you, but you're not exactly a brawler. Stop babying me. Yeah, I just fucked up four people. I'm not some soft boy to be left behind while you go adventuring. I can handle myself. I can fight. You're right, I should stop babying you. Let's give him hell. Yeah, I'll race you to the palace. Wait, no, just come with us, Anton. Don't race us. It is still day- oh, shit. Squad! Attention! Uh-oh, Alex. The portcullis is down and triple locked. Nobody's breaking into the palace tonight. We're gonna win this battle. Hey! We're gonna beat these upstarting little miscreants bloody. Uh, eh? And I'm gonna snatch my Blade Master title back from that stupid blonde twink. Um... <laughs> like, okay. Eesh, that, eesh, that's a lot of gods. <laughs> uh, think we could take them all? We fought worse odds, but with only an hour till the 13th hour. That's not enough time. We need a new strategy. Stilton. I'll keep the bastards distracted. You show the wild ones that secret you found. You got it. Secret? Don't get killed while I'm gone, Bree. Don't be daft. I'm a soft cheese by name, but I'm hard by nature. I'll take the whole guard and then some to bring me down. Right you are. You four, follow me. All right, little secret he found, and we got some good defense here. Yeah, I mean, just having George up there, honestly. Jesus. The dude's a fucking titan. This way. All right, Stilton. We were just over there. We didn't see anything. Uh-oh. Up here. See, I knew. I knew it, Stilton. I knew you guys had something up there going. This is just a shipyard storage room. Shh, wait, wait. Ta-da! Whoa, a secret tunnel. But where does it lead? Believe it or not, right into the palace. You dug this yourself? Nah, not me. I was the one who stumbled upon it, though. 
It's one of them fancy emergency escape passages. Arroyo must have had it dug eons ago. Well, no time to waste. Good luck, all. Give that yellow god hell. You're not coming with us? I've got my own fight to join. Gotta keep those guards occupied while you do your thing. All right, here goes. Thanks, Stilton. No need to thank me. Just go. Oh, well, okay. I was gonna thank you, but all right. Travel to the palace? Yeah, we gotta go. We're in the palace, baby. Steve, what news from Sergeant Alex? Uh, it's not great. Uh, word is things quickly got violent. The city's barricades were overrun, so Alex rallied every guard to defend the palace port cost. Every guard in one spot? Even the ones on palace patrol duty? Is... Is that bad? Return to your post, Steve. Yes, Blade Master. <laughs> yeah. Death gods above, rioters at the gates. Dear, oh dear, this is the most precarious situation. His Majesty's safety is paramount. We must leave the palace immediately. Yes, yes, we can use the emergency tunnels. One tunnel leads to the wharf, which will give us access to the underriver. A swift egress. No time to lose. Shall we go, Your Majesty? This is fortuitous. Your Majesty? The timing? It is fortuitous that the peasants cho chose to attack on tonight of all nights. We can solve two problems at once. I don't understand. Lord Master, send an urgent memo to Plague Master Aquila. Grant him the authority to use Excalibur, effective immediately. Ophiacus, hold that order. Your Majesty, unleashing Excalibur may deter the Yellow God. But if my understanding of the weapon is correct, it would kill countless rodents, members of your own kingdom, whom you are sworn to serve. They're riotous louts who wish to put my head on a pike. Their lives are forfeit. Lord Master, stop die hearing and write the memo. Oh, stop dithering. Die hearing. I just make up words, guys. Sometimes I try to go so fluid that I make up words. Stop dithering and write the memo. Um, Your Majesty, this decision is not to be made lightly. Please deliberate. By the gods, you're both pathetic. I'll issue the order myself. Your Majesty, what would your mother do? My mother? She desired strength and stability. Virtues that you know nothing of. Move. And dead civilians? Is that the price of a strong and stable kingdom? Unbelievable. How can a royal blade master be so naive? You should know better than all that this palace is built from blood and bone. Every right, every privilege, no. Our whole Rodentian way of life is maintained at the end of a sword. So don't stand there in the garb of a knight and act like you're better than our own violent institution. You are the bloody institution. Gods. He's right. I am such an idiot. It always has been this way, hasn't it? The palace of blood and bone. For as long as we've had kings who rule and peasants who serve. Perhaps longer. Ophiacus, go to the armory and fetch my needles. Your swords? All of them. Hurry now. Godspeed, Needle Knight. All right. Jesus Christ, Needle Knight killed the... Oh, shit. You! You're the... You're the worst. Shit. Traitor! What did you just do, you treasonous bastard? I didn't wish to spill the blood of my king, and I don't wish to kill my own brethren. It's too late for regrets. You've made your choice, king killer. Then come, attack me. But you've all heard the songs, you've witnessed my needlework. You know that when we cross blades, I will be the only one left standing. That's very true. Uh, he's right. Yeah, I'm not throwing my life away against the Vault Slayer. Has the Thimble God become a coven of traitors and cowards? Oh, friend versus friend. Diego, please turn away. Thou broke thy oath, Blade Master. I did, to protect the kingdom. What is a kingdom without a king? A king who murders his own people is not a king worth serving. That is not our judgment to make. Duty is not beholden to whim. And what does your duty say? Does it compel you to fight me? It compels me to execute you. I don't want to do this, Diego. You're my dearest, and you are mine. That makes the hammer of justice all the heavier. All right, shit. 
Diego and Leo fighting it out. That's going to go bad for, honestly, Diego probably. Like, Leo's a mean mofo. I don't want to fight him again, but I think I'm going to have to. No, well, no, because he switched sides. So maybe we'll help him fight Diego. If that's the case, Diego's scary tough. We're in. All right, but are we safe? Uh, that we don't know. Let's go see. Is there somebody down at the end of this hallway? Nope. Sir Gale, sharpshooter of the Thimble Guard, heroic defender of Two Tail Pass. All right, looks kind of like Harry Potter. All right. Yeah, not a creature stirring. Bree's diversion is working even better than hoped. So what's the plan now? Well, we have two threats to deal with, Excalibur and the Yellow God, but it's minutes to the witching hour. Which do we prioritize? I figured this might happen, and I've already made up my mind. You three go and stop the Plague Master and their doomsday weapon. I'll speak with the king. What? Alone? Yeah, I'll just tell him about the Yellow God and ask him about a route to the surface. Are you sure, Severm? You're not exactly, you know, an eloquent orator? Huh? You're bad with words, lad, especially around authority figures. Ah. You're right. But I don't think it'll matter. I, I doubt a fancy speech would change anyone's heart at this point. Are you sure you know what you're doing? You just focus on Excalibur. We trust you. Good luck, Severm. Oi, you can do it. Give him hell. All right, so these three are separating, going to deal with Ex Excalibur. Okay, let's definitely save it. The King of Jurors, save your game? Yeah, they're going to go deal with Excalibur, and I guess Verm's going to go try to talk to the king, which isn't going to go too well. So, wait, can I go in here? I already got everything out of there. Is there anything in here I could get? No, nope. Cornflower the Childish. Le Cunemon, le Hero, le Zécarpole. Le Carpole? I don't know. I don't know. My French accent's good, but my French understanding of French words, not so good. <laughs> All right. Um, let's go in here. Go in this way. Secret to Excalibur. Siobhan knows all the secrets. Oh, and up the staircase. Now she has friends. You guys remember this staircase, the long, long staircase. All right, going up to Excalibur. Let's go see Aquila. Hopefully Aquila will see reason. Is Siobhan going to land on her feet? Nope. She'll land on her feet eventually. Come on, guys. All right. Oh, we're moving. A strange workshop, a secret passageway, and now a godly lift. Where exactly are we going, Siobhan? Up. Excalibur is at the top of this tower. You think the Plague Master knows we're coming? Uh, let's see. Let's go find out. Yeah, we're going to do a save. We're going to do a double save. Because shit's getting serious here, guys. We need the old double save. Game's been saved, all right? There's Excalibur in the flesh. <laughs> uh, Aquila. Aquila! Odd. I was expecting a message from the king. Instead, I'm greeted by my apprentice, a lab rat, and a squirrel with a recorder. Whatever. It doesn't matter. The king's permission was nothing but a formality anyway. Soon the yellow god will make his entrance, and the power of Excalibur shall be revealed. We won't let you do that. There's nothing left for me to do. The system is fully automated. Soon the bell will ring its thirteenth chime. At that moment, the ballista will release, slinging the sky egg through this clock face to the halls below. The egg will explode, and the yellow god will perish. Along with half of Merida. Regrettably. Just over four minutes ago, Siobhan. Uh, just over four minutes ago, Siobhan. Can you dismantle Excalibur? I can try. And now, tampering with the egg, I cannot permit. Oh, I? You think you can take us? Take you? I'm an aging academic with no battle experience. Of course I can't take you. But I don't need to win. I just need to delay. Oh shit, alright. Fighting Plague Master Aquila. Oh shit, we have to fight 200, 240 seconds, damn. Oh shit, what the fuck? Okay, we're on a clock, we're on a clock. Hellfire. 276? Oh shit, Aquila. Yeah, we're gonna have to do some serious damage to this dude. Yep, Sky Vault. We gotta hit him with all the stuff we got. Alright, that took him down some. Sweet, uh, heal all eyes, improvise to create a custom effect. Why not? 
Oh, there's no time for improv. Shit. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> no time for improv is funny. Give a bonus turn to an ally? Yeah. Yeah, do another Sky Vault. Go, go, go. We gotta deal- yeah, we gotta just break all his stuff and make him deal as little as possible. 45, nice. Alright, and bleeding. Good, 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 good. Keela's bleeding. Summon. Uh-oh. Spread fire. No, she doesn't have it. She does have an overclock, though, so she can use that. Yeah, she'll just overclock. We need her to deal a bunch of damage. So, let's go, and then Sky Vault, she has one. Yeah, we just gotta keep dealing as much damage as we can. Do another Sky Vault. Go! And honestly, now just... You give her another turn. And let her build up stuff. Yeah, so she can just take a break now. Should've probably given that to Siobhan. So she could do her attack, but that's fine. Yep, we're gonna do that. We're gonna defend. Keela's still bleeding. What's this? Uh-oh. We have 146 seconds of toxic bomb! Shit, okay. Syntax error. Well, that worked out. Let's do worm fire. Yep. Let's just hit him hard. We got one overclock, so we're good. 47. That was good. And she's got three now, and she's stunned. Shit. Um, give her another attack. Hopefully she'll stop being stunned. I need her to really stop being stunned. Yes, no longer stunned. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. Boom. Right, 10 and took it down. We did it with 108 seconds to spare. No, we still got to destroy the stupid robot, really. Can't believe I got to destroy this dumb robot. Really? And I didn't even... Okay, well, it's up to you, Bruce. Take it down. <laughs> and Bruce with the final attack. Nice. 94 seconds left. All right. To think you could wield such a strength with godly trinkets... Rodent's life really is sh short and pathetic. Siobhan, there's no time to lose. Right. All right, let's, yeah, let's disarm this Excalibur here. Oh, no. There's, this is more complex than any godly tech I'm familiar with. Just smash it up. No, that's far too risky. Wait, I may not know the construction of the fire egg, but I know this ballista. Ropes and pulleys, cogs and gears. This is mole engineering. Help me turn this lever. I hope you know what you're doing, Siobhan. Shut up and pull! Alright. Alright, we're pulling it, pulling it, pulling it. Go, 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 pull it. We don't have a lot of time left. Uh-oh. Thirteenth chime. The bell! But nothing happened. Right, we disarmed the ballista. So Excalibur itself is still active? Yes, but it's not going anywhere. It, it poses no more threat to Muruda. Well, good enough, I suppose. No point hanging around this death egg. Let's mosey. All right, are we gonna? Is it gonna be back to Verm? All right, we're back to Verm, and he's gonna be going in there to quote unquote talk to the king. So I do think the king adjures. I think the king adjures quite solid. I'm going to adjure as well, guys. So I am gonna end this one here for the day, guys. If you did like this one, be sure to like, subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And of course, I want to thank all of my members right now. I've got two members. That's right. Rainbow Chicken Live has joined Spinning to Win in the members circle. So if you guys want to join the Cool Kids Club and get access to the private Discord, custom emojis, and a shout out at the end of every video, be sure to click the members tab and join. I sure do appreciate all the support I've been getting. Thank you so much again, Spinning to Win and Rainbow Chicken Live for both being members. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.